patient gets the confidence of going through the surgery going through the treatment once he hears directly from the another patient the message was that yes we can we can do it and that's where the idea of we can took birth i started working along with dr somshekhar uh, on this ki bhai how do we Uh, go about it how how we should you know uh, deal with patients what all to do not to do and things like that i started uh, reading lot of international literature on cancer on cancer survivorship and finally i also uh, did a uh, e learning course from asco university on cancer survivorship uh, just to equip myself with the right knowledge so that i deal and uh, with the cancer patients in the right way what we did was that uh, we structured a program uh, to take care and to do things in a uh, you know organized way so that it delivers the maximum to the cancer patients now to do this what we did was we divided it into three parts one the first one was on after diagnosis so what happens is uh, that a patient is all uh, the patient as well as the family is very very nervous about it and the best and the biggest question that comes is why me each and every cancer patient thinks why me that the moment a person is diagnosed with cancer we are the friends who will support and give the uh, you know give our hand uh, to them to go through the journey so therefore the first thing is we explain to them why what is the diagnosis what is the meaning of that diagnosis what is the meaning of the treatment that the doctor has you know suggested and how they will go through it and there's nothing to fear and because fear is the biggest problem the enemy number one is the fear and cancer the very word cancer brings in fear and therefore we work on that first so having done that then comes the second part now the patient is comfortable and uh, he is ready to go through the treatment so now the treatment starts the cancer treatment is not easy and it's quite a bit of a journey to go through the long drawn out uh, treatment of cancer it has its own aches and pains it has it's uh, it can you know really uh, depress the patient as well as the family so therefore again the patient and the family needs a friend to hold their hand and to take them through the journey the side effects of the treatment which are only temporary but even they they knock you down uh, so you need somebody to you know tell you and to take you along ki hey come on you can do it you can do it just keep walking and that's how we are there to support during the treatment now the next step comes is how to bounce back to my normal life how to bring back joy in my life how to live life rather than you know be in depression ki hey i've got cancer so that's not what has to be done therefore uh, you know we 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 intervene there and we tell them what all to do uh, to get back to normal life of course the very very important part is that we ought to teach uh, the survivors what should be their lifestyle what should be their diet for example so that the chances of recurrence is less finally uh, we make a survivorship care plan for each and every uh, patient or rather a survivor uh, so that you know that details that uh, gives the report that what all they should do not do how they should follow so that their life is you know back to normal and happy so this is the idea with which uh, we are uh brought in this uh, program support group so that people can get back to their normal life go through the treatment and enjoy life mm -hmm.